Hello everyone and in this video I'm going to show you how to set up Unity 5 and uh, make it work with Android SDK which is required for Android game development and application development in Unity 3D. First of all I connect my device Sony Xperia UST 25i. A link to the driver is in description below. Then I go to control panel and I click here you, you install a program and I make sure that I don't have any Java installed stuff. No Java JDE, no JDK so I remove everything. Then I go to the site with JDK8 and install this version. I have 32 bits system. I installed this application. I installed this into the folder disk C program files Java JDK but also application installed GRE for me so that's good we have two uh, things installed simulta simultaneously Okay, now let's go to next step. Then we go to command prompt. We press enter. And we make sure that everything installed correctly. We type Java C space dash version and it should show up the version of our Java so it's 1.8.0 underscore 40 okay and now we have to check our uh, global environment uh, mm, values we go to properties of our computer then we go to advanced system settings we go to environment variables and I'm going to show you what variables I have so I have this is my user variables and this is my system variables so that's how I have it working And then we are going to install Android Studio. To folder uh, D uh, slash apps slash Android Studio, and also together with Android Studio. This application installs Android SDK, which I installed in disks, disk D slash Android dash SDK. Then I go to Unity, I go to its settings, and set up Android SDK location as D dash uh, mm, D slash Android dash as the key, which is this location, and I show a JDK location, which is this one. And actually, I don't use an Android Studio for Android development in U Unity. It just what comes in the package with um, Android SDK in this video. And then 
we switch to Android we'll make sure that we are going to uh, publish to build and run some scene in my case test dot unity and we click build and run so I tried it yesterday actually in the midnight so this time I'm going to call it test2 dot apk and then it will take not uh, so long because the file is extremely small it's just a test uh, test project so that's uh, how it does work so I try to make it work with a standalone Android SDK with old version but with a new Java Java 8 but it failed failed a lot of times and then I decided to make a crazy step I decided to install um, Android Studio and it's working now now it's working so now it's pushing new content to my device and it will be working all okay except it will be only skybox because I don't have anything in my scene so just a simple package simple I mean not package application for Android Android so I guess that's all for this video and don't uh, don't look at this error it's it just it's just not error at all it's, it's not not a problem it will push my application to device so attempting to start unity you know I'm I unlock my screen in unity I mean not in unity in my Android device and I can see that that my screen is black and I have I, I can see a logo of unity and yeah it's working so application started on my Android device and this is working so guys thanks for watching this video I hope this helped you to get unity uh, 5 work with Android I mean mm, uh, unity 5 ready for Android game development or application development so once again thanks for watching have a good thing bye 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 and have a good time see you later in the next video of something very interesting or maybe not very interesting Bye! Ooh.